get yourself. Where do you come from? Dublin. Oh, Dublin? Oh, but it's hard to get there in Dublin when you're not from there.
The trophy which you see there, which he got, was presented, I'm sure some of you have seen uh, a young lady over the last few days going along snapping people and taking photographs. You've seen them at all the Atlantic yards. In the juicy was the lady who presented the, uh, the trophy. And now Ian is going to give us a tune. Off you go.
sent a Jewish player to, just to have him on this year. That's Marie O'Reilly from New York. <laughs> and Deirdre O'Grady from Ratoth, County Meath. Via Donegal and Mayo. <laughs> and Chicago. Who's the man behind him? The man behind him? This is uh, Philip, isn't it? Gavin. Gavin, Gavin that's right, yeah. <laughs> Hey, this is Tommy McDermott. Where are you from, Tommy? Uh, Listen to Skay. Born and bred in Listen No, born in Rosley. Born in Rosley? Rosley for. till I was over 20 and then got married and living in Listen Ski now for the last 36 or 7 years. Where's, where's the way from, Tommy? Away from Listen Ski. Is that right? That's how you happen to be coming to that that's, part of the country? That's how I come to be in Listen Ski. You have a long tradition of singing, apparently. Oh, why? Well, yeah, I Goes away back to when? Well, one. Uh, all Ireland in 1965 in Thorlis. In Thorlis? Yeah. And had you been okay. going to any flowers before that at all? Oh, I had. had uh, I was at the first flower in Monaghan in 1952. And yes. I've been at flowers over the years, of them all over the place. I didn't go to them all now, but I went to a lot of them. Mo mo most of them? A lot of them, yes. Most of them, them yeah. And after you, went, you won in 65, did you ever enter? No, in? never competed after that. After that? No, no. You, you went to I, 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 I competed in 64, you see, and, and uh, was beat to come second in, in 64 in Clonus. Right. Uh, in all Ireland, and uh, decided I'd have a go at it the following year. So when I got, when I won it, I just didn't bother. Time you couldn't compete again. Uh, yeah, you had to wait for three years. Is that right? Uh, that was yeah. the rule that time. Yeah. It's not it's like now, if you won this year, you'd automatically right. go through the following it's year. It's changed since, yeah. Mm. But that was the rule that time, yeah. If you won, you couldn't compete for three years. What about so. that flaw in 64 in Clonus? I wasn't at it now, was it the one in 68? Yeah. Was the one in 64, was it a big flaw? Oh, it was. Oh, it was very big that time. You see, it was the Whit weekend that time. Right. And uh, it used to be very big crowds. That's really, you used to get a, an element that wasn't really after music, you know, and, and that's why they changed it then to the August weekend. Right. Yeah. Uh, they changed it to the August weekend, possibly in the late 60s or early 70s, I can't remember just when, but it used to be always at the Whit weekend. And when you, you, when you won in, uh, in 65, do you remember who the adjudicator was? I do, I, the, well I knew, I know who one of them was, I, I, and there was a couple of them, I'm not sure who, uh, uh, Mrs. De Bruyne from Castlereagh Ray, Roscommon, was one of the adjudicators. Right. And uh, I'm not sure whether Seamus Duffy maybe from me over. I'm not sure about that now. There was three of them, I think, at that time. But I, I can't, I can't say who the others were. I knew, I know, I know, I knew who all right. And how many songs had you to sing at that stage? Ah, well, you, you, you could sing two songs. Yeah. And in it wasn't, wasn't compulsory now. You could get away with one if you wanted to sing one. Well, in '65, was there a provincial? Was there an Ulster oh, flag? Oh, 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 Where oh, was, was it that year? Uh, the Ulster flag that year. Not sure. Could heal maybe. Uh -huh. And then you'd uh, already entered in the Fermanagh flow before that. Maybe could heal. I'm not sure about that. Uh -huh. Could heal a couple a couple of years. Do you remember what you sang in it? Oh, do sure. Do. What I, did you sing? I sang Matt Hyland. Matt Hyland. Uh -huh. You maybe give us a wee uh, blast at it later. Uh -huh. But you're going to sing us a song we're talking about yesterday coming uh, down the, the river flan. Finn, the lovely river Finn. I, I was uh, I lived on on the banks of the river Finn at Rochley for the most of twenty years. Right. For people that wouldn't know, although it mentions all the places in the song, where does the River Finn rise? The River Finn rises in the townland of Corner Creeve, it's beside Knockner Cross. What and county are you in now? Oh, you're just outside Rosley. In Fermanagh? Ah, in Fermanagh. Right. And uh, it comes then, it flows down through Rosley and uh, it goes through Springgrove and into the, the Free State then bypasses Clonus. Uh, up round by Ballyhoe and comes back into the north again at Wattle Bridge, about uh, four or five miles from Newton Butler. And, and flows into Loch yeah. and that's the, the. Which of the locks is that? I get confused. Which is Upper Loch and Lower Loch It's the Upper Loch Upper Upper yeah, Loch yeah, yeah. And a lot of people you were telling me yesterday coming down here sing the first verse of this song. Uh, they, have, they, they haven't the geography right because uh, I don't know, somewhere along the line that possibly maybe they made it just uh, to suit wherever they were from yeah. or whatever, I don't know how it got uh, mixed up but they have it coming through Newton Butler and Listen to Ski which it doesn't like it. it right. That is the route of the, uh, the, 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 the geography of it is what, what I'm after telling you there. That's right. the, well, you sing us, sing us, uh, sing us a version that you know and right. is, which is more accurate okay. than the parent. <clears throat> well, I was born in the year of eight in the town.
town land of Ballyhoe, where underneath that old stone bridge the river fend a flow from college land down through Rossley, passing Clonus on its way to Wattle Bridge, where it joins the air that flows on to the sea. When I was young, I went to school in a place they called Clonry. Twas the dwelling place of gentry in days long, long gone by. There were forty scholars on the roll. They kicked up quite a din. They were reared in homes convenient to the lovely little thing. Our teeth was a master man, a kind old soul was he. His assistant was a local girl, a Miss McAlfrey. At the stroke of ten, we'd lift our pens, our lessons to begin. Back home at four, we would roam the shore of the lovely river thing. Oh, how I love to fish for trout along that mossy shore. But those boyhood days are all gone by, and they'll never come back no more. And how I used to troll for pike and watch the spoon bed spin when the wind was west. The sport was best on the lovely little thing. Ah, but now I'm old and getting gray, and all aged men must die. In that green graveyard by the convent's church, let my old bones gently lie. And up above with the one I love, a new life I will begin. And never more I roam the shore of the lovely river Finn. Lovely, Tommy. I'd say you're singing it every bit as well, if not better than 28 years ago when you won the alarm. <laughs> I don't know so much about that, Eamon. Oh, it's a lovely, lovely, Keep trying, a lovely bit of singing. Uh, you're going to sing us a song now, Matt Hayden. This is, uh, this is the ballad that I won all Ireland within in Thornton. You know anything and, about the history of it at all? Uh, Master Raymond Murray T. Davenant was a great, uh, he was the first president of the Cultus and he looked it up and, and uh, he could never really decide. There's a very popular ballad all over around the Monaghan Fermanagh area. And uh, he thought that it might have originated in, in Wexford, but uh, I don't think that he was 100% sure. Yeah. But it's, uh, it's uh, one of the old stories of the servant boy fallen in love with the landlord's daughter and they banished him from the island and she pleaded and won him back and 
that's lived happy ever lived after. Lived happy ever after. It's one of the these ballads that, that lived happy ever after. A lot of them mm. don't end that way, but this one the, the, this could have a good end. end. Yeah. There you go, Tommy. There was a lord lived in this town who had a handsome comely daughter. She was courted by a fair young lad who was a servant to her father. But when her parents came to know, they vowed they'd make him leave the island. This lady knew her heart would break. Had she to part with young Matilan? The Lord discoursed his dear wife fair one night alone in their bedchamber. Matt Highland, I will send far. I fear my child does stand in danger. This lady gain ambush. Lay while deep depressed, she lay repining. My father, I will him deceive. Won't I protect my own Matilan? Straight way off to her love she went and ordered him for to awaken. Arise, my dear, and go your way. This very night you will be taken. Last night I heard my father say, in spite of fate, he would transport you. So rise, my dear, and go your way. For you know right well I do adore you. Oh, must I go away, he said. Oh, must I go without my wages, without a shilling in my purse, just like a poor forlorn stranger. Here's fifty guineas in bright gold, Ain't that far more than my father rose you? So take it now and go your way. For I wish to God I'd gone before you. It was on the bank they both sat down. Just for the space of one half hour, and not a word did either speak, but down their cheeks the tears did pour. She laid her head beneath his breast. And round his neck her arms entwined them. Not a lord, nor duke, nor earl I'll wait. I'll wait for you, my own Matthilan. The Lord discoursed his daughter fair. One night alone as she lay repining, 
I will give you leave to bring him by Since there's no one you style about him She wrote a letter then in haste For him her heart was still repining she brought him by to the church they went And she made a lord of young Matt okay. Good man, Tommy. Lovely. This thing I was going to ask you earlier and then I didn't get around to it. Where did you get the tradition of singing from? Mm. Did you... Oh, my mother was my mother was a great singer. Is that right? Uh, unfortunately, she died young, forty-five years of age, and when I lost, some you lost her, a lot of songs. Yeah. Uh, I, I, I got some of them right there. Yeah. What was her name? She was McDahey. McDahey. What part uh, was she from? Rosley country. She was from Rosley. Yeah. Mm. yeah. That's a pity, you know. Well, any of the rest of your family was in your family. Uh, there was five of us. And the rest of them sing at all? Oh, the, the rest, they, they can all make a shape at it, you know, but... None of them have the same interest as you? Not have. really, no, no. The, well, many of the brothers sing in the choir and are stay there. Yes. But uh, 